Well, let's move right on and democratizing, uh, democratizing flying is not an easy task. That's the word coming in from the Aviation Secretary R.B. Chobe. Speaking to ETNA's Executive Editor Supriya Srinath at the Global Aviation Summit, uh, he said that innovation in aviation remains the focal point. Dinesh Keskar of Boeing also spoke saying that airplanes that reduce flying costs are the way forward for the company. Let's listen in to a slice of that conversation. What we are seeing is a constant need for number one cost reduction because the fares we are paying today to fly from A to B are continuously going lower and lower. We have to find ways by which we can create airplanes and create operational economics so that the airlines can still make money in that tough environment. Because what happens for the airlines is Fuel price is something they can control, and that's a major component of their cost. And if they can control that, what can Boeing do in terms of reduced maintenance costs? The future of aviation, as we look at the current generation of aircraft, which are what I'll call subsonic airplanes, which mm -hmm. fly below the speed of sound, I think is more going to be how to reduce the cost, how to make it cheaper, how to go faster, how to go further, these are the needs. And in the next level, I would say another decade or more away, the two areas I think we will be looking at, and we are already doing research in our innovation centers, one is hypersonic airplanes. We think uh, the day isn't far in some people's lives who are in this room that they can fly from uh, Tokyo to New York in two hours.